on Rosh Hashanah, on the Jewish New Year, one of the central themes of the prayer is to listen to the shofar, the sound of the ram's horn. And the rabbis tell us that why do we have to hear the sound of the shofar? It's a wake-up call where God Almighty turns to us and he says, children, come home. It's a new year. We spend it 48 hours of Rosh Hashanah reflecting on the past year on our actions and our deeds, and we want to change, we want to repent. So the sound of the shofar is that sound that comes from the inner essence of our soul, where we turn to God Almighty and we say, Father, please take us back home. Allow us to return to you. It's interesting to note that you would think on Rosh Hashanah, the most important prayer would be words. But he says, no, it's a wordless sound. Why? Because we have so much to ask for on the Jewish New Year. We have so much to pray for. We have so many needs that we want God Almighty to be able to give us and to fulfill. So we say, God, words are not sufficient to express our prayers. We have a special time when we sound the shofar because the ram's horn represents the inner voice of our soul. Where we say, God, you know what we need. You know how our, our year was. Now please bring us back home and allow us to reconnect to you once again. And not only do we blow the show from Rosh Hashanah, but actually in the Hebrew month of Elul, which is the 30 days preceding Rosh Hashanah, during the weekday we also blow the show for every day. Why? As a reminder, as a preparation for Rosh Hashanah. So I'm gonna blow the show for now, and we have to remember that, you know, think about it for a moment. Imagine you had a prince who has who was exiled from his father's table, he's no more in the royal family, and after years and years, and he rebelled, he forgot the language, and he doesn't look like a royal child. But after many years, finally, he comes back home, but he doesn't speak the language. So what does he do? From far, he shouts, Father, Father. And the father hears that voice, and he says, that's my child. That is the sound of the chauffeur. No matter how our year was, God Almighty says, you call out, I will respond, and please God, for all of us at Jewish Care, all of the residents, the staff, the families, and all the volunteers, the sound of the shofar should be a sound of prayer, the sound that God Almighty gives us perfect health, happiness, success, and this coming year should be a much better year for each and every one of us. I'm gonna blow the shofar now, and please God, the prayers will be accepted on high. Wishing you all a Shana Tova, happy and healthy and a sweet new year. Thank you.